Hey everybody, I'm John Fort. Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella took the stage here, right here in New York today to unveil the Microsoft Surface Pro 3, what Microsoft calls the first tablet that can actually replace a laptop. Really? Well, we'll tap the opinion of Shara Tipkin, senior writer uh, at CNET. Shara, so this is 800 bucks basically just for the tablet, another 129, 130 bucks for the keyboard behind it. Is this really even competing with tablets? I mean, at that price point, not really. You know, the $800 price is the most expensive iPad Air. Um, you know, and for a lot of people, that's even getting too expensive. If people want tablets, a lot now are going for the really cheap Android tablets that you can get. So for Microsoft, they really do have to position this more as a laptop, which is definitely what they're trying to do here. I was talking to an Adobe executive here who was saying he thinks that the best positioning of this is actually against the MacBook Pro. It's powerful enough that creatives might actually be interested in the tablet hybrid uh, perspective here. Microsoft at the same time arguing they're not competing with OEMs like Lenovo, HP, Dell, who they need in their ecosystem. Are those companies actually going to be okay with Microsoft taking this tag? The last time around, like when Microsoft introduced the first Surface, the PC guys were definitely very angry, you know, and that caused a lot of them to start looking at Android. I don't think that Microsoft positioning them, positioning the new Surface as a laptop replacement is going to make anyone happy, especially when these guys are trying to kind of do the same thing that Microsoft is. So, you know, it's, it's going to be interesting to see what happens, but I don't think Dell or HP or Lenovo right now is probably thrilled. So you've got uh, Intel cozying up with Google with Chromebooks. You've got yes. Microsoft uh, doing this tack against, some would argue, its own ecosystem with Surface. You've got Apple. We don't know what they're going to do, but we should hear more from them in the back half of the year. Is Satya Nadella making the right moves at Microsoft in this kind of chaotic technology landscape? You know, I think he is. It's, it's a very tough time for PCs right now. Last year, I believe, was the worst year of um, sales, you know, the biggest drop that, that we've ever seen. You know, this year is supposed to fall again, next year as well. So he has to do something to kind of get, get Microsoft into these new areas. Today, he pointed out, you know, mobile first, which is something we've heard from Facebook, we've heard from basically everyone. So it's, it's definitely reality. You know, I think he's taking the right steps, but we'll just have to see how this ultimately all plays out. Yeah, it seems like the mark of success here will be if not only Microsoft can sell a few million Surface uh, tablets, but also HP, Dell, and Lenovo do better than they have in the past. We'll see how that works out. Shara, thanks for joining us, everybody. We'll see you next time.